welcome to this video where i will demonstrate the functionality of my application irs energy iso data uh, this application accessing energy data from the major independent system operators isos in the united states uh, the idea of uh, this application uh, came based on the uh, sustainable development goals uh, defined by the united nations so this is the 12th goal uh, we are stating ensure sustainable consumption and production patterns. So, based on this uh, goal, uh, I am getting the data, uh, the production, demand and supply of all these energies uh, from these three uh, ISOs. So, here I am using the uh, production extension, IRS Interoperability Framework. So, where I am using Python uh, to use with the production and this ISO data uh, library uh, which uh, I just uh, showed this the documentation and all these details are here. So, uh, at the end uh, we are getting the result. So, this is our final output. So, we are getting the title, this is the ID and this is the detail and the total production uh, MW is a unit the time and these are the energies and this is a production and this is a percentage so this means the natural gas uh, is the highest uh, energy uh, is in production and uh, is uh, the percentage is 52.1 and this is a total demand and this is a supply so this is uh, using a docker this is docker as application we can use uh, zpm as well so uh, we need to clone this repository so you can just copy here and uh, by using visual studio dot code uh, we can go to source control and we can clone uh, as i already cloned this uh, repository uh, once it's cloned we need to make sure to run the docker compose up uh, just by right click and we can say compose up so I already uh, done this so my container is al also running so this is my container and the application is running so let's start the uh, let's go to the application and then I'll come back to the source so let's start the application by clicking uh, here that this is a production running in the container we can use uh, super user and sys uh, is a password ok this is our production which contains uh, three uh, business services this is california service is1 and pgm service these are all these are all three isos and this is our uh, process uh, which filter the uh, data and, and transferring it to the operation so the we have these three operations uh, and these operations uh, at the end will write uh, the data in the text file uh, so uh, let's start the production okay okay our production is started so uh, all the and this services process and operations are running now so let's see the details uh, refresh okay so these are the messages for business service so this is the content so this is California service California ISOs the total production and all the uh, energies and their production and the percentage and uh, this is a trace so this service is uh, just transferring data to the process and this is our process is getting the data and then passing to the operations based on the uh, title so here is uh, uh, Yes, this is calling the California operation, IS1 operation, RPGM operation. And this operation at the end, 
uh, writing the files so this is the content uh, and so this they are writing in the text file so this is our trace uh, so the service is calling the process and process is calling the operations so this is our view of the uh, production so let's go to the code so all over the services process and operations are basically python libraries then these uh, python libraries uh, connecting to the object script class and this uh, class then connected to the production uh, i'll just show uh, that all the details so this is a python this is our code uh, demo and this is the iso data uh, actually this application basically cloned by uh, the template by uh, mr rongier uh, this is uh, uh, it let me open it so this is a interoperability embedded python so we have all the details here so here i'm uh, this is this is our python uh, libraries so this is a business service so business service is basically uh, this business service is uh, connecting to the uh, this business service which is uh, coming from here uh, this is a object script class business service so this is a business service and this business service basically is uh, extended from ens to business service so this is how it's linked to the production uh, so what is doing basically is uh, importing this uh, uh, library python library and then uh, this is this is initial these are the some parameters it's initializing this is our uh, target and then here is uh, uh, I mean on task is getting the uh, ISO because this is California so based on this ID is getting this connecting to this uh, ISO and then is calling the functionality to get the data uh, demand and supply and this information is passing to the class which is this class where we de define all the parameters and after that this class is uh, passed by the message so business service here uh, if, if all fine we are just uh, passing this to our target which is our process uh, this filter routing rule which is at uh, this process filter routing rule so again this process is uh, uh, inherited from is using this business process and this business process extended from uh, business process extended from ens dot business process so this is how it's connecting to the production so what is doing let me go to business process so it's just uh, taking the uh, this request the data and based on the uh, title is just uh, selecting the target either is California operation PGM or IS1 operation so let's uh, go to the operation so this is our operation so this operation again is uh, uh, we are importing this business operation objects keep class and this class business operation is connected to uh, ENS dot business operation so this is how it's linked to the production so this operation what is doing is getting the data and uh, on message it's writing to the file so this is a custom message uh, custom function uh, write to file it's taking the information from the request and then it's uh, putting to the file and the title is the same with id of the iso and then it's putting to the file this is another custom function so so this uh, files uh, is written here in the python they are putting the files here irstf app output 
so let's uh, open these files in the docker okay so in from the uh, visual studio we just go to this docker i just install one extension docker go to files this is irs dev uh, app and this is output so here we have uh, all these files created this is uh, for the california service let me open so so this is a these are the detail for the color this uh, uh, operation and this iso data this is total production mw is a unit and this is all the energies and this is the production and this is a percentage and same with the is1 this is another iso and it has these uh, energies and again same the details and same with the pj pjm so uh, this is the detail so uh, that's the flow of the application so once again this uh, production basically is using the pax uh, production extension uh, made in python and then it's, uh, uh, connecting to the isos and these services are just getting the data and uh, we are passing to the process which is just uh, uh, based on the title sending to the operations and these operations are writing the information to the files uh, so thanks for watching